Aperture value is one of the fundamental aspects of exposure, and it can seem like the most intimidating. The easiest way to think about it is as the name of the size of hole through which your camera sees the world. A bigger hole lets in more light, a smaller hole lets in less. But its naming system can be confusing. For a start, a smaller number represents a larger hole. And also, the relationship between the numbers relates to the square root of 2. And I don't know about you, but I can't spontaneously think in terms of root 2, so I've just had to memorise them. The key thing to learn is that changing your aperture by a whole stop doubles or halves the amount of light that your camera sees in exactly the same way that doubling or halving your shutter speed does. With time, you'll learn that f2 is twice as bright as f2.8, and f4 is half as bright. And this ability to capture extra light is the main reason why wide aperture lenses tend to be bigger and more expensive. As well as letting in more light to give you better image quality in low light conditions, a wider aperture also gives you shallower depth of field and blurrier backgrounds. But that's a story for another day.